crazy cutter coming at you on this Halloween night. I, yeah, I'm a mess right now. I just got out of my costume. Um, here, here's a photo. Anyways, yeah, it's not very, uh, very easy to breathe in it. Anyways, I figured let's just do a, a Franken Stout from Block 3 Brewing Company. Now this actually comes from a place actually not too far from me, uh, St. Jacob's, Ontario. Um, yeah, so it was brewed. Uh, yeah, October. It was a bottle October twelfth, two thousand sixteen. Uh, it's five percent. Uh, in the bottle, we got hops, yeast, malts. You got your Magnum, Columbus hops, American ale yeast, uh, two row chocolate wheat, uh, Carafoam. Abbey and rye malts. Great thing comes in small batches. So, Franken stout. Let's give this a shot. Mm, right away, you can smell the chocolate. Man. Mm, smells like a great stout, actually. Let's give this here. That is that is black. That is a dark stout. Smells good. That's a pretty good stout. Actually, it's um similar flavor to one I've actually made. Uh, myself, home brew. Very nice. The only thing I have to say about it though is when you see the name Franken Stout, you know, Frankenstein, big, big. big. Um, I actually thought a higher percentage um, of alcohol may have, I don't know. You know, I guess in the end, it tastes good. So you didn't do anything wrong, so it's good. But for some reason, I just I would expect something at a higher percentage from the name. But you know, really nice stout. Mm. Yeah, there's no no weird aftertaste, nothing. This is great. Really refreshing after. Uh, you know, spending half a day setting up for Halloween. Uh, just tear it all down in a few minutes. And, uh, you know, relax now. Anyways, I hope you all had a happy Halloween. Cheers.